If you're thirsty, chances are you can turn on a nearby tap and safely take a drink. But it's not so simple for millions of people around the globe. In some areas, water is scarce. In others, it is deadly. Some experts warn that we are in the midst of a world water crisis. There's enough water for all of us to do everything we now do for a long, long time, but it's not always and frequently is not in the right place at the right time. Much of the planet we call home is covered with H2O, yet less than 1% of that water is fresh and available for drinking, bathing, or growing our food. As world population increases, access and supply become bigger challenges. The link between water and health is already critical. 25,000 die every day, mostly children, for lack of water and food. 6,000 die each day from waterborne disease. To solve this crisis, we need cooperation, integration, and innovation. Water testing technology is crucial for all of us to meet the challenge of protecting the world's most precious resource. These are our water samples. We're going to be analyzing those for about 25 elements, like lead and arsenic, uh, cadmium, mercury, hazardous elements people really don't want in their drinking water. Perkin Elmer is a global leader in human and environmental health technologies and leads a global environmental health initiative called EcoAnalytics. In developed countries, microbial contamination is pretty well understood and under control. So what people worry about there is really about things like lead coming out of leaky pipes or due to industrial spills. In developing countries, primary concerns really are around microbial contamination. Perkin Elmer recently unveiled a new generation of inductively coupled plasma mass spectrometers called the Nexion 300 series. Fast and super sensitive, it allows scientists to keep up with changing regulations, lower concentrations, and new contaminants. One of the things that we see coming down the line is a lot of concern about chemicals at lower concentrations that we haven't looked for in the past. For example, pharmaceuticals and personal care products. Now the bottom line is that it's keeping people safe, keeping people healthy. Measurements are going to be a critical part of our world. More water analysis, more control, more cooperation. It's the sort of future that will allow our grandchildren to drink deeply and safely from our most precious resource, our water. Eco Analytics from Perkin Elmer for a brighter tomorrow.